Hi friends, today I am giving a lecture on number systems in digital logic design or switching theory and logic design. Generally, there are four types of number systems used in digital logic design or switching theory and logic design. First one is binary number system. Second one is decimal number system. Third one is octal number system. Fourth one is hexadecimal number system. Now we go for each and every number systems. First we go for binary number system. A binary number system is generally used in digital computers because in digital computers we have to use switching circuit. This switching circuit have generally two states either zero state or one state. Zero state can be represented as off stage one stage can one state can be represented as on stage okay so these two state devices are transistors diodes etc a transistor may be in off state or are on state off state is nothing but zero state on state can be nothing but one state. A diode may be either in off state or a on state. Off state is equal to zero. On state is equal to one. Okay. So these devices may exist either in off state or a on state. So because of the reason, a binary number system is used in digital computers. A binary number system has base or radix is equal to 2. Because of that reason, it consists of two independent symbols, either 0 or 1. Okay. A binary number system has a positional weighted a system. What is positional weighted system? Suppose we are taking a binary number. In that binary number, every bit is called as a binary digit. So this digit has a particular positional weight based on its position relative to the binary point. Okay. The binary point separates the integer part and the fraction part in a binary number. Okay, suppose we are taking a number, so 0, 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0.010. 0. Okay, so this is called as binary point, binary point. So, before the binary point is called as integer part, integer part, after the binary point is called as fraction part. So, this binary point separates the integer part and fraction part. So, every bit is called as a binary a digit. This binary point separates the integer part and fraction part. Okay, so this is called as a binary number. Simply we can say that a binary number is a sequence of either zeros or ones. Okay, so each and every digit in the binary number has a particular positional weights. Generally, these are the positional weights used in binary number 
a system okay so before the decimal point the positional weight starts from uh, right to uh, left so 2 power 0 2 power 1 up to 2 power n after the binary point the positional weight starts from 2 power minus 1 to 2 power minus k okay now each and every binary digit in the binary number is multiplied with the corresponding positional weight then we are getting the products these products are added then we are getting the equivalent decimal number for a given binary number okay so this is the introduction about the binary number system then we go for decimal number system